how far out there I can get close to this uh, one of these uh, ships. Yeah, we are getting there. We're getting closer to that ship. Unbelievable. I'm a ways out too. Well, when I get to the ship, I'll show you how far. Just incredible, incredible, incredible. So again, downtown Vancouver. I counted 11 ships in the harbor and north side of Vancouver, so, wow, look at how far we came out, I'm almost at the uh, ship, and that is where the van is, way back underneath those houses on the cliffs, wow, unbelievable, and if you go right down there, you've seen that in one of my previous videos, that is the Lions Gate Bridge. That's how you go from downtown Vancouver to the North Vancouver. So it's a, you have to go across the Ocean Bay and Stanley Park is right down there between downtown and North Van is Stanley Park. Just a spectacular day enjoying this. Wow, I can't believe how far out I am. Um, okay, by the end of tonight, the water level will be right up to the top of this marker. So, and it usually happens pretty fast. Tide comes in pretty fast here. So, and back to the van where I was. Oh my God. That's a pretty uh, fast speedboat actually. Um, wow. This guy's a brave soul. It's not exactly warm out, it's April, so it's still cool, but he, nothing's stopping him. So it has been quite an eventful day, and I haven't been up very long. It's uh, pretty amazing. Well, there's a lot of sail ships. I guess you probably can't see. There's a lot of sail ships around downtown waterfront. And a kayaker coming by here in between the uh, freight ships. Okay, nobody said this was a good idea. Eesh. There's a lot of purple seashells out today. Wow, a lot, a lot. Anyways, uh, yeah, I guess we have to run for it. Okay, it's a little tough to walk without sucking my shoes off. Uh, I have to turn them. Not a smart idea going this way. Eesh. Ah, uh, you know, I'm gonna have to come out this way more often. Um, I don't know why I don't come out here more often. It's so quiet, peaceful, serene, and of course, fairly beautiful. I thought they were buzzing it. Yeah, I think they went in to attack and probably try and steal the eggs and eat the eggs. Yeah. Yeah. So do you go back to Winnipeg uh, every year? Or? I haven't been back. I went back last year for a few days last time. And uh, not this year yet. I'm undecided what to do this year. Anyways, kind of funny. 
I was hanging out in the parking lot making dinner here and I got recognized by uh, uh, a fella here so he stopped by and we chatted for like an hour or two hours at least so uh, means my supper I didn't get to finish <laughs> so I'll go back and finish it off and end our day uh, yeah it's cooling off now a lot really cooling off had this guy pull in too he's having a barbecue out there in the back windows doors open yeah nice day you all mm. oh what the hell that's something laying behind the van Gee, brr. yeah cold Okay, this is where I end my video on a chilly night. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, it's been a great Easter Sunday. Uh, time to myself. Um, I was going to work on the van, but it didn't happen. And maybe I just needed to relax a little and uh, think over a little bit of everything. And I ended it here perfectly, doing a, a short-ish 15-minute meditation. So, uh, I was going to go downtown and get some salsa dancing in, but that won't happen. Instead, I'm going to go chill out and do some more reading. So, I'm boring, I know. Oh my god. Um, I did want to go out, but yeah. Uh, conflicting interests. Reading or going out. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyways, cheers. Thanks for watching, guys, as always, and see you next time. Stay awesome. Until then.